Hi, welcome back to another video. You probably heard the toilet flushing in the background. <laughs> so today, oh, if this is the first time here, thumbs up this video, click like and subscribe and comment below. Um, so as y'all can see, we got a bowl of rice and uh, some chicken. You know, if y'all can try to. Job. Actually, I'll give y'all a good look at that chicken. Just cut this one. You know, there we go. I don't know if y'all can see that. Oh, shit. I'm gonna miss. I don't know if y'all might be able to see it or not. Either way, so we got some chicken and rice. I'm just gonna pour this generously. All right, so I'm back. So hopefully y'all got good views on this chicken and rice. I'm hoping no, that's better. We ain't getting back up. All right, so this was the B Loves Mukbang on a Budget Challenge. I don't know if it was an actual challenge, but I seen someone else post it, and I also saw in her video where she was talking about um, mukbanging. Um, you know, you know, you don't have to always be so expensive. So I did one of my childhood favorites. I'm sure there's a lot of other people's childhood favorites. Very simple, very easy. You'll see it in the montage. And um, put in a big bowl <laughs> and we're gonna eat. So I did chicken and rice, as you can see. Got some chicken and celery and onion. And um, of course I um, slow roasted the chicken and some cream of chicken and I think cream of celery or something. I can't really remember, but first bite. It's a big bowl. Mm. So I did it. I'm probably gonna be all this. So I did it like my grandma do it. And she ain't in the mood to do nothing special. You just cut the chicken up, throw it in the cream of all the chicken. <laughs> I didn't shred this or nothing. I just put bone, everything, whole chicken. Y'all having a good day there? Thumbs up this video if you're having a good day there. 
It's cold outside. And look, this was that simple meal. If y'all can remember coming home from school to them simple meals, this is one of the ones we had going. This bread definitely brings back memories. Oh, but the challenge. So the challenge was move banging on a budget. So this is what I chose to do. I, I can't wait to see what other people, um, how they do it. But this is just my, one of my childhood favorites. But this was under $10. So what I did, I went to Kroger. The rice was a dollar. Mm, excuse me. <clears throat> So the rice was a dollar, can of cream chicken, a dollar, and the chicken, $5.99, the um, chicken that they be having baked, with the flavor already in it, yes, yes, and then I put in that cream of mushroom and cream of chicken, mm. This is what you want. This is what you need. A good cold day. Mm. You know it's gonna be good tomorrow. Now for stuff like this, I will say, even though I did put some breast meat in there, I love the breast meat, even though I did put some breast meat in there, um, stuff like this with stuff where you like, um, you know, broiling and stuff, is best with dark meat. I'm not a dark meat fan, but... That dark be good and stuff like this. Straight on bone. Simple, easy, and under 10 bucks. <clears throat> Excuse me. I wish I could remember who I was watching. I don't remember who I was watching. I can't remember. But she was doing it. I don't know if that's a good idea.
Giannis almost fit with her already. I'm like, wait. So long. Moving too fast. I was afraid. I don't know why I was a little afraid that breast meat wasn't gonna do right. It's not dry at all. It's tender. And then I got a big old country bowl of chicken and rice. <laughs> Definitely brings back memories. Growing up in the projects, we did chicken and rice a lot. Didn't really understand why. Until I got grown and saw the value of a dollar. How much food actually cost. Because your boy had no idea. I'm just gonna be real with it. I <laughs> I thought food grew on trees because my mom always made it happen, you know. Mm, I see did three children. Mm. Mm, I see did I'm going to have to take my glasses off. I take the glasses off because it, it puts a glare on the um, on the screen. So quiet. Mm. I see my grandma had never made chicken and rice like this. I probably would have choked on that bone. Because I'm used to her. <coughs> Excuse me. She ain't finally chopping up no chicken. She's gonna throw the whole chicken in there. Bone and all. Burr. By the time she gets them stirring the bone here, well. Why is this so tender? Oh my God. Oh, the um, Dutch oven back there. Amazing. Amazing. Pray about something so simple. It'd be so good. That's so simple.
Yeah, get your pool too. <laughs> first before I do the um before I do the meeting for you things to get more subscribers first yeah I think that would only make sense so we're gonna hold off on that <laughs> hold off on that um, but I can't wait I can't wait to do it um it's gonna be fun it's gonna be fun I want to do another fruit video I'm gonna go grab some fruit definitely um you know, I love fruit, fruit like literally every day. Have y'all tried those, uh, what are they called? Naked smoothies? If you haven't, I'm gonna put one on the channel one day so y'all can see the one that I drink. Uh, it's very good. It looks healthy. Um, if you didn't know no better, it probably would taste healthy too because like no sugar added or anything like that, but it's really good. Really good. I don't know, that's a little off topic, I know, but yeah, it's really good. content. I ain't gonna lie. And stuff. 
night. <laughs> Alright, y'all. I'm out. I'm full. I'm still only want to get up from this chair. Peace.